Sir. Hi there. I'm, I'm Troy Simonson from the Romeo Area Tea Party. Oh, good. And I have a question. The Simpson Bowles Commission spent about a year working on uh, uh, a way to balance our budget and uh, how to balance taxes and cost reductions. And I wonder what you think of the recommendations of the Simpson and Bowles Committee. Yeah, thank you. I, I think very highly of their recommendations. Let me start off by saying that. I find it extraordinary that the President of the United States would bring together a group of such esteemed individuals from both sides of the aisle and say to them, how can we balance our budget? And at the same time, how can we create tax policies which encourage growth? Because both are important. If, if you just cut, if all you're thinking about doing is cutting spending, why, as you cut spending, you'll slow down the economy. So you have to, at the same time, create pro-growth tax policies. And so the Simpson-Bowles Commission attempted to do that in their own way. Uh, I, I'm not endorsing every single aspect of their proposal, but I'll be coming out with some proposals of my own this week that describe how I cut, how I create more pro-growth pro tax policies. And you've got a sense of that in my little book. I describe I want to see a flatter, fairer, broader-based tax system, and that's one of the things that they do in their proposal. So we... We've got to have pro-growth pro tax policies, cut federal spending, and also deal with our entitlements to make sure that current retirees never worry that they're going to lose Medicare or Social Security, and that future retirees, people today in their 20s, 30s, 40s, or early 50s, that they also understand those programs will be there for them and not bankrupt, bankrupt them in the process of getting to their retirement.